Nigerian men, as we know, they get a lot of negative PR. They do. They won't lie, no smoke without fire. But I feel like let's build them a slightly better press pack. They'll make you feel like you're the only girl in the world, even if you're not. That part. <laughs> I think they're loyal and traditional. I think that, like... Even if there's a wife at home back in Nigeria, they'll still marry you here. Stop the cap. <laughs> Stop the cap right now. Stop the cap. No bullshit, bro. So, I can appreciate that. They are charismatic. They will funny their way into business. They'll funny their way into... Okay. <laughs> into, into anything. Stop, my... stop, stop. What do you mean by that? They're generous yeah. with their time. Yep. And their money. Yep. They will they pop know, bottles. They will. They have a good time. Yeah. A Nigerian man that can dress well. They, they do. And they got the chat. They, there's a sweetness. There off. is. Oh, That's yeah. Maybe a bit too sweet. Because mm. right now, why am I charmed? <laughs> <laughs> why am I charmed, baby? Although they are not beating the mummy's boy's allegations. <laughs> at least they're respectful to their mums. That part. That part. I think together, mm. darling. Yep. That was the we have just reinvented what it means to be a Nigerian man. Yeah, go get yourself a Nigerian man. <laughs> go get yourself a Nigerian man. Yeah. <laughs> you want to bamba? You want to cheat with the big boys? Now you the wrong, get the kitty, you the wrong, get the get a coffee drink, what a drop cup. Ha! Hey! So you see how the thing goes? You know, once again, Nigerian men, we are trending. You know, somehow, somehow, we shall define ourselves for inside media. We always find ourselves trending one way or another, either positive or negative. Nigerian men must trend. And you know me now, as a Niger guy, you know, <laughs> I'm here to bask in the glory. You know, Nigerian men all over the internet, everyone, all the ladies, they are going crazy. Well, you know, slow down, slow down, yeah, slow down, we got you, we got you. But as a proud Nigerian guy myself, you know, we gotta be doing something right. But let's take a look at why the internet is going crazy, why all the ladies are just going, ah, find me a Nigerian guy, find me a Nigerian guy. In LA, it's terrible, but as far as, like, in comparison to, like, different spaces, yeah, I will say Nigerian men are probably, like, top, yeah. The top men in it. pinning me to say it. So, oh, I mean, like, listen, but, I feel the exact same because I love them so much. It's like, damn, I've really got to say this, man. That you're, oh. Uh. But I love me some Nigerian men. I but love a yeah, Nigerian no, man. Nigerian I'm late to the Nigerian men train, you know. I'm but not going to lie. Yes. But I'm, I think I've arrived. This is, yeah. <laughs> I've arrived. This is and, I'm like, and I'm like, oh, hello, hi. Hey. Hey. Yes, and we're like, welcome to you now. I'm very, I'm very late, Gina. but please, if you will have me, if you will have me, I'm Can happy to stay. Gina. Oh, Literally. Hi. hi, Gina. <laughs> yeah, no, definitely Nigerian men are great. Um, what is the biggest takeaway from this entire experience? The biggest takeaway from this experience is that I'm going to do it again sensational one thing i have realized as a american woman since i stopped dating american men and i started dating african men more so nigerian men is we as women were and are settling for the bare minimum with american men example nigerian men african men whatever they will bow down to your feet literally they will not watch you struggle they know how to take care of home. They know how to respect their marriage, in a sense. Um, but, and I love American men. Don't get me wrong. I'm American myself. But I feel like our men weren't raised to, a lot of us grew up in broken homes. So it's just normal in America for our men not to know, you know, how to treat their women or how to love properly or just how to be masculine, in a sense. Like, so this is your sign to stop dating men and settling for men because that is your type. Try something different. I started dating African men a few years ago. I will never look back. Forget the gym. Forget dieting. If you want to lose weight, get with a Nigerian man. I beg. Hey, oh God. The more I stress to your life, you will never know peace again. Everybody be like, oh, I want me a Nigerian man. I want me a Nigerian man. You like stress. You like problems. You will never eat again. Your mouth will be... Mm. Mm, mm, close like this because you will put putting stress in your life. Ah, they are so toxic. Toxicity king. Ah, you'll be living in a toxic waste dump if you are dating a Nigerian man. Ah, they are fine. 
don't get me wrong. They be fine. They be mm, delectably fine. But baby, they will add stress to your life. You will never know peace again. Ah, you'll be going through emotions. Hey, why am I feeling like this? Why am I feeling like this? Because you were a nice dreamer. They're never going to give you peace, baby. You can like them for the aesthetic. But baby, to be with them, ah, you will lose weight because you'll be stressed. The fuck you thought this was? Really? Say, congratulations, you played yourself. When you switch off the lights, the light goes off. You wow. switch it on, it goes on. Wow. That's to tell you that sh when you wear a shoe, it does not really count how a farmer feeds his dogs. Mm. Wow. Wow. You get it? If you don't get it, forget about it. So what have you heard about Nigerian men? Mm, well, the ones that I've met, they're all cute. I want to look good in guys. But other than that, that you guys are real respectful and stuff. Okay. Nothing so else other than that. Alright, so you think I'm cute? Mm. It is what it is. What have you heard about Nigerian men? You ooh. must be Nigerian. They, ooh, they don't <laughs> know, baby. <laughs> Lord have mercy upon you. I heard they all about culture though. I'm not even gonna yeah, lie. And I heard that y'all be wanting to um um circumcise y'all females clicks and shit. I beg shut up. Real good. Y'all love bit with me. Y'all love what's up? <laughs> love that is not correct. I'm not gonna look skinny hoes. <laughs> good thing I ain't skinny. <laughs> Are you not ashamed of yourself? Okay. Uh oh, wait, 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 wait! Whiteness, motherfucker! What? What three countries would you say has got the best looking guys? Nigeria. Oh, say like. See, the type of love a Nigerian man would give you. He would give you the love that you've never seen before because he knows how to spend money. It's sweet and it's spicy. <laughs> Sensational. I know. I never was a beard girl until I met one mm -hmm. <laughs> beautiful cultured people he's a yoruba guy mm -hmm. i love nigerian yeah. men say so. i love how you guys look yeah i love how you feel i love your abilities oh my god i'm never leaving i'm never leaving i'm in this shit forever You get it? Okay. If you don't get it, forget about it. In South Africa, some women, especially like this affluent women that like the flashy lifestyle, mm. they prefer Nigerian guys because the Nigerian guys, they give money. Yeah. So whether they, they're dating you or it's just a one night smash, mm. the Nigerian guys still pay money. Just like, you know. No, uh, it's business, no love. It's, it's not just business. It's like even when you're dating them, they say, you know, they still treat you better on average. Yeah. Than, other guys. I think I understand Nigerian men better and I can tolerate them. What are you saying? And also mm -hmm. is how free I am around Nigerians. What? I can joke around and they can understand my jokes. Ewan. But when my experience with South African men, when I joke around, they take it very personal because uh -uh. maybe I'm used to Nigerians. So I feel when I say, are you mad? And then you'd be like, you know it's a joke, depending on how I sound and the conversation. But when I say, are you mad to a South African? Yo, so you think I'm crazy, you understand? So I think also the communication for me <laughs> is easier when I communicate with Nigerians than South Africans. Daggy. Not that I can't date a South African anymore, I sure can. Are you confused? But my preference, I would prefer Nigeria. Because we got them. We fucking got them. Between Nigerians and Ghanaians, oh, who's better looking? Question. Who's better looking? Nigerians. <laughs> I'm sorry, Ghanaians. I'm sure you guys are going to hate me for this, but you know now we just have to add. I just have to add a little bit of spice. You know, I have to. I have to put in something light. You know, just for banter, nothing serious. And for those of you that are thinking, ah, Nigerians hate Ghanaians or Ghanaians hate Nigerians, absolutely not. We love each other. As a matter of fact, if you guys want to test how much love we have for each other, just come for one of us. And you will see, we will destroy you immediately. I believe that Nigerians and Ghanaians are the only ones that have license to come for each other. Any other country, uh, they're going to be destroyed. 
So I love my Ghanaian fans, Ghanaian brothers and sisters. I love you guys. It's all fun. It's all banter, out. Nothing serious. And I hope you guys enjoy this compilation. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And if you want to understand what it feels like to be a Nigerian, click on this video here. And I'll see you guys in the next one. I'm out.